So today we are out here looking at a commercial meter, trying to isolate and determine that it is first and foremost working correctly and to determine what it's supplying. First thing to note on commercial properties is you're gonna find a lot of the times that you have multiple meters, multiple backflows. So on this one here, you have your commercial meter located here, which then goes to your backflow. This backflow is on the same as the backflow for your irrigation. Typically you'll find that irrigation does have its own meter, but in this case, we're looking at a single meter system. Over here, you can see your digital readout on this meter. Some meters are going to have a dial that spins. This one has a digital readout that'll tell you right away whether or not you've got water running. As you can see, everything is staying stable, which means that we have an a system without any leaks in it at the time. If we wanted to determine whether or not this meter had a leak on it, we'd be able to open up this lid here and take a look at this dial and watch our digital readout here. So as you flip it between the settings here, so this is your flow. You currently have flow running on your meter which means that there's water actively running. Other systems you're gonna to want to isolate your irrigation away from your domestic to then determine which one is actually leaking. If you're experiencing high water bills and you are able to find the serial number on your water bill, you can actually look right here on your meter and it's got your serial number right here. If you're able to match that up to the one on your high water bill, then you know that you're working with the correct meter. So now the next time that you've got high water bills, you'll be able to take these skills and apply them to your own meter and then hopefully be able to do some troubleshooting before you have to call the professionals like us.